So now let us do a quick revision or a last minute revision on the subject of physics for class 12 CBSC. So covering the chapter number 6 so that is electromagnetic induction. So we have in this particular table the summary of some important formulas at a glance. So we have the physical quantities, their formulas and their units. So in the first physical quantity the magnetic flux so represented by phi. So its physical formula is B into A in the vector form and that is equal to B A cos theta and that is can also be written as so integral of B into D A and its SI unit is Weber and that is also equal to T M square and its dimensional so formula is also given in the last column and for the physical quantity the induced DMF we have so so given by the formula epsilon equal to minus d phi by dt and the induced current i is given by epsilon divided by r and that is also equal to so capital n divided by capital r into d phi by dt and the induced charge q is given by so induced current into delta t and that is also equal to minus n by r into delta phi and the motional EMF induced in a straight conductor for a linear motion is given by B into L into V and for rotational about 1 N is given by B L, so B L square into omega by 2 and the SI unit of induced EMF is volt and its dimensional formula is given in the last column and for the physical quantity of self inductance we have its formula given by L equal to phi by I and also L equal to so mod of epsilon divided by di by dt and the self inductance of a long solenoid is given by L equal to mu into r into mu naught into n square into al and the unit of and the, and the SI unit of self inductance is Henry and the dimensional formula is given in the last column and for the physical quantity the mutual inductance so is given by m equal to so phi 2 divided by i1 and m12 equal to so mod of epsilon 2 divided by di1 divided by dt the mutual inductance of two long coaxial solenoids is given by so mu naught n1 into n2 pi r square l where m also equal to so we have so L1 into L2 under cube root and further we have the unit of the SI unit of mutual inductance is Henry and we have the physical quantity for magnetostatic energy stored. So given by U equal to half into Li square and its unit is in Joule. So this so table so gives us a a summary of all the important formulas and their physical quantities and their mathematical definitions. So now let us take up some of some more list of some important formulas we have. The so flux phi equal to B into A in vector form and that is equal to B A cos theta and E and E is given by so minus N D phi divided by D T and that is also equal to minus of so phi 2 minus phi 1 divided by t and the negative sign indicates that the induced DMF E opposes the change in the magnetic flux and the induced DMF E is also equal to B into L into V and further I is given by the induced DMF divided by R and that is equal to B into L into V so divided by R. Then we have I equal to the current I equal to phi 2 minus phi 1 divided by T into R that is equal to minus N by R into D phi by DT. The induced GMF E equal to half into B L square omega where EMF is induced across the rod of length L and E equal to E naught into sin omega T into omega that is equal to 2 pi V R omega equal to 2 pi F. E naught equal to N B A into omega and I naught equal to E naught divided by R 
and that is further equal to n b a omega so divided by r. Uh, further we have i naught equal to e naught by r and flux phi equal to l into i and induced gmf e equal to minus l into dl by dt we have the self inductance l1 plus l2 plus l3 so on up to ln equal to n so when the inductors are connected in series and when the inductors are in parallel we have self inductance l equal to so l1 into l2 divided by l1 plus l2 and further we have l equal to so mu not n square a divided by l and u is given by half into li square the induced gmf e equal to minus m into di divided by dt and mutual inductance m is given by mu not into n1 n2 a divided by l and this is further equal to mu not into n1 n2 into a into l k is given by m divided by square root of l1 l2 and i is given by i not into e raised to the power of minus of r divided by l into t i is also further equal to i not into 1 minus e raised to the power of minus r divided by l and further you can see the graph with respect to i and t and also you can see the graph with respect to i and t so in this two slides so this completes the quick revision and the last minute revision on this chapter on so chapter number 6 so that is magnetic induction so this finishes the the covering of important formulas and some definitions so leading to the last minute revision okay thank you <music>